Hello and 5v6 muggles. This is a very important video, so please watch till the very end. And watch out for videos we tag as important, as you will understand the reasons soon. So today, we will be giving a detailed breakdown on what NFT is. Non-fungible tokens, or NFTs, represent a new class of digital assets that are unique, indivisible, and verifiably owned on a blockchain. Unlike cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin or Ethereum, which are fungible and interchangeable one for another, each NFT carries its own distinct metadata and provenance. This singularity makes NFTs particularly well-suited for representing ownership of digital art, collectibles, virtual real estate, in-game items, and other one-of-a-kind assets. At their core, NFTs are smart contracts, self-executing programs deployed on a blockchain that enforce the rules governing creation, transfer, and destruction of tokens. The most common NFT standard emerged on Ethereum in late 2017 and is known as ERC721. This standard specifies the minimum interface, methods, and events that a contract must implement to allow wallets and marketplaces to recognize tokens as non-fungible. Later improvements, such as ERC1155, added the ability to manage both fungible and non-fungible tokens within a single contract reducing transaction costs, and improving efficiency for batch transfers. Creating an NFT, often called minting, involves uploading the digital file or asset to a storage layer and then executing a smart contract transaction that records the token's metadata and assigns initial ownership. The metadata typically includes a link to where the file is stored, on-chain or, more commonly, on decentralized file storage networks such as IPFS, as well as details like title, description and properties, for example, rarity traits in a digital collectible. Once minted, the token exists on the blockchain ledger permanently, and its ownership history is fully transparent and immutable. NFT marketplaces offer user interfaces for discovering, buying and selling tokens. Some marketplaces, like OpenSea or Rarible, allow anyone to mint directly through their platform, automatically handling storage and contract deployment. Others, such as Foundation or SuperRare, operate on an invitation or curation model to maintain a high level of quality control and exclusivity. Buyers connect their cryptocurrency wallets, typically Metamask or similar Ethereum-compatible wallets, to these platforms, where they can place bids or purchase tokens at fixed prices. Auctions, reserve pricing and royalty settings are built into many smart contracts, enabling creators to receive a percentage of secondary sales indefinitely. The use cases for NFTs continue to evolve. Digital artists were among the earliest adopters, leveraging the ability to prove originality and scarcity in a medium that had long struggled with piracy and endless copying. Musicians have released albums and exclusive content as NFTs, attaching experiences such as backstage passes or limited live stream access. In gaming, NFTs can represent in-game assets that players truly own and can trade outside the game environment. Virtual worlds and metaverse projects use NFTs to denote land parcels or avatars, giving participants autonomy over their digital spaces. Beyond entertainment, NFTs are being explored for real-world applications such as tokenizing real estate deeds, luxury goods authentication, and academic credentials. Several benefits arise from NFT technology. First, provenance and authenticity are natively verifiable, reducing fraud and counterfeits. Second, creators can program perpetual royalties, ensuring they earn ongoing revenue as their work changes hands. Third, programmable scarcity allows fine-tuned control over supply, creating digital rarity. Finally, Interoperability between wallets and marketplaces fosters a global ecosystem where assets can move fluidly across platforms. However, NFTs also face challenges and criticisms. Environmental concerns have been raised over the energy consumption of proof-of-work blockchains like Ethereum, though migration to proof-of-stake consensus, as in the Ethereum merge, has significantly reduced carbon footprints. Gas fees on congested networks can make minting and trading cost prohibitive for smaller projects or individual creators.
Questions remain about the longevity of off-chain asset storage. If a linked file becomes unavailable, the token's utility can vanish. Legal frameworks regarding intellectual property rights, taxation and consumer protection in NFT transactions are still nascent and vary widely across jurisdictions. Speculative behavior and price volatility have at times overshadowed the technology's potential for building new forms of digital community and culture. Looking ahead, several trends point to the next phase of NFT evolution. Layer 2 scaling solutions and signet chains aim to lower transaction costs and increase throughput, making NFTs more accessible. Cross-chain interoperability initiatives will allow NFTs to move seamlessly between blockchains, expanding the market and reducing fragmentation. Dynamic NFTs, which can change appearance or metadata in response to external data or holder actions, are opening up novel interactive and gamified experiences. The integration of NFTs with Web3 identity systems may enable token-based reputation scores and membership credentials for online communities. Meanwhile, traditional brands and institutions, from sports leagues to luxury fashion houses, are increasingly experimenting with NFTs to engage audiences and explore digital-first offerings. In sum, NFTs have shifted the paradigm of digital ownership, introducing verifiable scarcity, creative royalties, and new modes of interaction. As technical infrastructure matures and regulatory clarity improves, NFTs are poised to underpin a wide array of digital and real-world applications, granting individuals unprecedented control over their digital assets and creative economies.